Legendary college basketball coach Bob Knight has died. He was 83 years old. Bob's family confirmed the news to ET. In a statement, they shared the sports coach died Wednesday at his home in Bloomington, Indiana, surrounded by his family. Quote, we are grateful for all the thoughts and prayers and appreciate the continued respect for our privacy as coach requested a private family gathering. The Knight family asks that in lieu of flowers to honor Bob with a memorial contribution to the Alzheimer's Association or Marion University. At this time, an official cause of death has not been revealed. Winning the Big Ten didn't make any difference. And winning the national championship didn't make any difference. If you will continue to work and follow what we want done, you have the ability to go undefeated. And anything less than that would not be the equivalent of what your capabilities were. Bob, also known as the General, is remembered as one of the most successful coaches in NCAA history. Leading Division I men's college basketball teams, including Army, Indiana, and Texas Tech from 1963 to 2008. I don't remember just going in and really raising hell with them. I think I did it very quietly. Bob was inducted into the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame in 1991 and the College Basketball Hall of Fame in 2006. Bob even lent his coaching knowledge to Nick Nolte while filming Blue Chips, a sports film about a college basketball coach. Oh, Bob Knight is great. Bob Knight, he, he opened up the whole process of the game. He let us come in and, and, and go through all his practices and, uh, and uh, go back in the locker room and see how he works and everything else like that. He's Tremendous teacher. Well, he's totally easy to work. He's just a, he's a very, very much a, a, a perfectionist man. And his idea about what collegiate athletics is about is that, is that his basketball program is to be the best, the best class at, at uh, University of Indiana that they can possibly be right. at uh, Indiana University. So he wants his kids to walk away from that class having learned emotionally who they are, how to get up after a loss, a defeat, how to operate in life. That's the most important, and then winning is part of it too. Mm -hmm. But, uh, and he's very protective of his ball players. 